All right, from soaring to the sky to sailing in the sea, it's time to go see our boy Drake and deal with his dilemma. Hawk launches an assault over the inland sea. Can Drake weather the storm? Ugh. What are the current whereabouts of the enemy forces? The troops appear to be gathering uh, on a small island on the inland sea. Yes. As expected. And our troops have surrounded the sea, yes? Yes, sir. A complete wall encircles them. All that remains is to destroy their unit by unit with the black cannon. Much could happen before they are annihilated, so we can't relax just yet. Tell the other troops to keep on their toes. Yes, sir. Enemy troops everywhere. If I don't find a way to turn the tides quick, every last one of us will be swept away. What to do? I could approach directly, but I might sustain some cannon fire. Perhaps I'll transport troops to the HQ by the way of landers. Sir. We have an incoming call from Commander Eagle. From Eagle? Patch him through. Drake, are you okay there? We've hit a spot of a rough sea here, Eagle. The enemy's got us surrounded. For now, I'm merely focused on saving my troops. Hold on, I got some good news for you. Oh, let's hear it. I received a message from Ghoul Comet. Yes. They sent reinforcements, and that's not all. They're led by Commander Kanbei himself. <laughs> Kanbei? That is good news. All right, T, I plan to launch a counteroffensive timed with Kanbei's attack. You're gonna aim to take out those two black cannons, right? Oh, yeah. Yep. We can mop up the rest of the enemy force once that's done. Hmm. Got it. In that case, I'll request that Kanbei's troops target the black cannons too. Woo! Thanks, Eagle. You have the sailor's gratitude. Save it for the victory celebration. Good luck to you, Drake. Commander! It looks like Black Hole has the inland sea surrounded. Hmm. And one of Green Earth's Commander Drake. Sir! He appears unharmed, sir. Let's establish our field HQ close to the greener Earths. That's complete. We'll send troops directly from our bases. Our mission is to eliminate the two black cannons. <laughs> so, you think you got Commander Drake cornered, do you, Black Hole? Prepare to taste steel from both sides. Alright, so Drake... Where is it? There it is. A former pirate with a big heart, his naval units rule the seas, but he has trouble with air units. Rain seems to follow him wherever he goes. Drake's naval units gain plus 1 to movement range and plus 10 to their defense. His air units, however, suffer a minus 20 to, to their firepower. Rain does not affect his unit's movement, and he has a small chance to make it rain uh, in random weather. His favorite is the sea. His dislikes are heights. Seal Power Squall causes a storm to do 1 HP of damage to all of enemy units and reduce their fuel by half. Drake's units gain plus 10 to defense. His super seal power is Typhoon, causes a storm that inflicts night winds 2 HP to all enemy units and reduces their fuel by half. Drake's units take, uh, gain plus 10 to defense and also causes the weather to change to rain. Drake is definitely one of the better CEOs in the series because, you know, naval units are the pinnacle of the warfare in this. While he is not the best when it comes to air defense or air, uh, aerial attack, his, his naval units are like second to none in terms of how good they are. And to show it off, let's target these rockets. The only problem with Drake is that it takes a while for him to actually get good because, as you've seen with past missions, naval units are incredibly expensive to purchase. I thought there was a spot of infantry here, but I guess not. Let's just get some infantry down here and we'll capture the space. But for the time being, uh, we're just going to have to make use of what, what units we have under Drake's command, and we are just going to have to plan accordingly. We're going to hide some of these units in the reefs nearby to help uh, conceal their location, but also provide good targeting spots for our our battleships. Dive right there for the time being. I just want to see where. Okay, so right there. 
right there, so right here would be a good spot. That way we can target both of the rockets. Alright, we're gonna dive below. We're basically gonna be using the reefs as cover to sneak our naval fleet all the way down to where the black cannons are to destroy them. too far out and see just because I fear there might be some rockets hiding out there so for right now if it's not a sub we're not going to keep them too close to the land unless there's like a, a reef nearby because reefs can seal all naval units that sit inside it as basically they are the woods of the sea now something interesting to note is I never understood why it was Conway that comes to help with Drake's forces and not like Sonya because this definitely screams it's more of a Sonya uh, theme mission than it is for uh, Convey. I mean, I guess you could understand if like you can get like a rocket unit uh, saved up, built, and then brought over here to absolutely annihilate this black cannon. Because this one basically has the entire Inland Sea zeroed in, so until we can deal with it, we kind of are up creek without a paddle. Oh, I didn't even realize that that was caught out in open sea. Whoops. I'm gonna guess those are mediums coming this way. Or it could be artillery. Alright, I'm not gonna kill you. I'm just gonna scare you away. I need to keep you from targeting my fleet. some mediums coming in. So if Kambi could get one of his troops up to this missile silo, definitely would help in really putting a hurt to Hawk's forces. Sail to get some rockets for Eagle. We're gonna put them right here. I don't believe that Hawk has any naval units. Like, yeah, there's a dock right here that is pretty close to his forces, but I don't think he ever attempts to capture it. But he does have a good number of enemy forces there. Like, I think that he does have like a couple of medium tanks sitting over there waiting to ambush you. to be able to get that uh, rocket. So let's just keep getting some more infantry to capture these properties. Uh. What an unexpected little twist. The Gold Comet Army wants to play too. It would be rather problematic if they decide to use those missile silos, although I believe that the cannons are built to withstand such attacks, are they not? Commander Lash says that the missiles won't even leave scratches. <laughs> if that's true, we have little to worry about. Gold Comet does not yet have many units deployed. We shall not let them build any further. Attack them immediately. An ounce of prevention, as they say. Alright, 
Let's get you moved over here. Let's get the sub up here to scout out a little bit further ahead. Looks pretty clear, although that artillery definitely is going to be an issue, especially if I want to try and target the the black cannon's uh, power generator. Safe spot to drop this off so that the cannon doesn't hit it. Right here. Almost got it. I think one more day should be it. Uh, no, it's gonna take a little bit more because of the fact that we only have one city to our name. I am kind of, uh, yeah, I think that battleship's going to get hit. I just realized I think he is just within the range of th those rockets. I should have went up above the, the small island instead of below it. Or maybe not, because maybe he can't uh, see my battleship just yet. Oh, yeah, that's right. He can't see it. dropped it off right here, but now at least that thing is zeroed in, ready to attack. Right, we'll get you deployed. We'll start taking the fight to you. guys from getting a little too bold. Let's see, 53 fuel. You could use a refueling soon. 87, 80, 41. Yeah, the subs probably could use some refueling. should all be gathered right up here.
Nope, not using Black Wave. But he will go for that silo. there. Yeah, I think if we hide in here, yep, so we'll be in range. Okay, uh, I think I might just save it for Typhoon. Because what we're mainly trying to do right now is just slow the enemy down until our naval units can get within range to target their, their cannons. And, well, the first one's already in range, and hopefully I can get the money from for Kanbei's forces to be able to afford a rocket to help with uh, taking out the first cannon. Okay, there's a rocket right there. I think tomorrow we should have enough money to be able to get that rocket. I'm kind of surprised. I'm. Why is he not using? A, I'm. I'm actually kind of nervous now. Why is he not using the seal power? Usually, you'd open up with it.
1600 for the medium. Alright, well, no doubt about it, he's gonna use the Super CEO power tomorrow. So I think the only thing I can really do at this moment, I need to keep that there because yeah, it needs refueling, is just get my troops ready to brace. That's going to drop it down to three, so it's going to be doing less damage. But maybe I can combine the two battleships together to get it back to full health. hitting that cannon. is Hawk doing? Like, I'm... Why is he not using his Super Seal power? I kind of figured that he would have opened up with it. What is going on here? Is he just playing, like, psychological warfare on me or something? That's the only explanation I can think of. I'm really getting kind of nervous that he has not used Blackstorm yet. We I want to keep this inside of the the city. Nope, still is not using it. At this point, I just don't even know anymore. Alright. 
how is this looking? 46. Actually, you know, the battleship should be able to get around here to hit it from behind. Okay, there's where the majority of his forces are hiding. At this point, I'm kind of wondering if Hawk is just letting me take the victory here. And he, he's like uh, just trying to assess how good am I under pressure. That's the only explanation I can think of for the fact that he's not using. Are you prepared? You know, sometimes I just need to stop poking the bear. Black Storm. He waited just until I did not put my rockets into a city to heal him up. First cannon down.
Oh, hi. How's it going? Of course he had tanks hiding in the, the forest. Away. Typhoon! Uh, don't you just hate it when the weather suddenly turns sour? And all of your fuel just gets washed away?
I'm getting really sick and tired of these rockets, not gonna lie. And I would love to figure out where they're hiding. Okay, it's gotta be one of these fours right here. Oh, these poor tank drivers. Didn't even stand a chance. Another one? Ah, oh, jeez. I think I might know exactly where that one is, since the one that's over to the right of the, yeah, the cannon that was destroyed.
No, I didn't want to target him. I misclicked. I want to go with the rockets instead of that infantry. Oh, well. What's done is done, and it can't be undone. Alright, so long as nothing goes bad, we should be able to have this wrapped up in, I would say, a couple days. Got this in the bag. And there you are. Oh, I see what you're trying to do. They're gonna try and sneak these guys onto my turf. God, give Kanbei a Neo tank, and it's basically just game over for anybody who decides to go against him. Like, I literally don't think anything can stand against Kanbei's Neo tanks. Like, maybe, like, an enemy Neo tank with, like, a defense bonus from, like, a forest or a city. But even then, they'll, they'll be hard pressed to do any counter damage. try to do that to try and mitigate my battleship damage. Oops. 
I really haven't been paying attention to the health of the fleet up in the bay up there. And it really does show. It's like once you get like one or two of your naval units down here, you basically don't even have to worry about uh, the, the fleet that's sitting up by the small island. Like I don't even know why they give you three missile silos in an airport up there. I never understood it. around let's finish this off the black cans were destroyed those useless hunts of very well Ugh, very well we'll withdraw for the moment adjust our preparations commander Kanbe. Ah, commander drake i'm quite pleased to see you unharmed i can't thank you enough for this surely you have gone down with our we should, surely we'd have gone down with our ships if we hadn't come through Nonsense. Although surrounded, I'm certain you would have t earned the tables and emerged victorious. We merely hastened the process. A vote of confidence from the commander himself. I won't soon forget it. Ugh. It'd be an honor to battle at your side again someday. <laughs> the feeling is mutual. <laughs> Maybe that day will come when we're both storing Black Hole's fortress. May that day come soon. Until then, goodbye. Goodbye. With some rough sailing. I can't believe the thing that really bit me in the end was power because I didn't destroy enough of Hawk's forces. But then again, you really don't have to. 